Hello friends, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Let's just get right into it. So, this is not the first time I've tried to film this video. If you notice that my face looks a bit yellow and jaundiced, it's just the green makeup that never came off after I showered twice and makeup wiped several times. So, that brings us into what we're doing today. It's going to be something I like to call spectacular. Um, we're doing a halloween -y makeup tutorial. Well, maybe not halloween -y. Who Who knows when this is going to be posted. We're doing a makeup tutorial for Princess Fiona in ogre form from Shrek. So, get ready. Without further ado, let's get the heck into it. I have to work at 6.30 in the morning. I don't know how this is going to go with like green paint all over me. I'm not going to be doing my neck today. I'm sorry if that disappoints you, but... Once again, I have a job, you know? I don't know. I just... <laughs> so, <clears throat> let's talk about some products really quick. So, what we're going to be using today is a variety of cream paints I got from Walmart. If I'm going to create a brand, it's going to be exactly who I am, which is just, just on top of subpar. So, they didn't have any green paint, but they had blue and they had yellow. And I used my little fifth grade art skills to remember that blue and yellow make green. Um, and so we're gonna be doing that for our base today. <sighs> yeah. My face over the last three days has broken out like the plague in the 1800s. It's been horrifying. Was it the 1800s? I don't know, I'm not really good at history or anything else for that matter. Also, a side note, I tried to film this, like, literally two days ago, and I still have glitter all over my eyeballs. So, yeah. We're going to start with the eyeballs today. I'm not going to put an eyelid primer on, and that's just because I like to live recklessly. We're just using an NYX, or NYX, if you would like, concealer. I use Tarte Shape Tape on a daily basis, but I don't want to use it for this. It's not as thick, but it is a really nice full coverage foundation from my point of view. <coughs> okay, so then we're gonna go in with the NYX finishing powder, HD finishing. So, what I'm gonna do is take my e.l.f. My e.l.f. brush. I'm gonna take my e.l.f. brush and I'm gonna go in with this. And we're just gonna go all over the lid where we just concealed. The fact that translucent powder works as a transition shade on me. Okay. Now that we got that out of the way. I think this still had like some brown on it from like whatever. I don't care. I'm just a person. So we're going to be going in with our Morphe palette. I don't know which one this is. 35-0. I can't read. So yeah, my 35-0 palette. And I'm going to take <clears throat> a Morphe M433, and I'm just going to take, yeah, I'm going to go for this shade right here. The idea for this look for the third freaking, freaking time, time is to just wing it out from the crease, and I'm not good at this, so like, Manny Amue, don't come for me. James Charles, please, have a seat. We're next going to... Next, we're gonna go in with this color over here. Here. Oh no, I made a mistake. I made a mistake. I'm not claiming to have any kind of idea as far as technique or strategy goes, so just don't don't come for me. I don't care. I don't want to hear it. I know I'm not a beauty guru. I never will be. Uh, no. Whack, dude. Oh my god. I just dipped into the prettiest sparkly color with my freaking nail. Kind of wrecked it. So we're going to take that NYX concealer and kind of just put it directly where we're going to be putting the glitter and the glitter primer. Now, I'm going to tell you ahead of time, once again, I'm not a makeup artist. I'm not good at cutting a crease. Please don't remind me. I won't care. Or maybe I will really care and that's just a defense mechanism. But either way, please don't remind me. Now we're going to go in with this product called Glitter Stay by Hard Candy. Not sponsored. But we're just going to go with this one. 
So like I mentioned, this is straight up just a glitter palette. This I believe is also from Hard Candy. Yes, um, it will stay on your eyes for multiple days, but it's so freaking pretty that I don't mind. I love that for me. I should have done. See, you know what I did? I decided to change which glitter color I was going to use at the last minute. I should have done a darker look to accompany that, but I didn't. So here, here we are. are. Anyways. So since we have a bright red wig, we also have a bright red brow pencil because it's a costume and we're going to have fun. It's going to be a great time. Oh, okay. I don't know if I feel worse for me for having this on my face or worse for you for having to look at it for the rest of this video. But <sighs> what I can say is this is interesting. Yeah, I can definitely say it's interesting. If we can, I think we all agree that this is interesting. <sighs> this is starting to take a turn for the worst, you guys. And if you're looking at this and you're like, oh my gosh, it doesn't look that bad, I want you to really look at it. Yes, it does. Wow, it really really is. Is. And then we're going to use the Benefit Professional. Just because. <coughs> Excuse me. Just because, um,. I don't want green makeup getting into like my trouble spots with my pores. I really don't. So we're gonna go in with this white cream makeup first. That's kind of stained green a little bit. Don't judge me. Well, the sponge they give you sucks. Just letting you know. The clown makeup palette for $2.97 ripped me off. This is what we're doing. I don't have the time for this, folks. I don't. <sighs> Who am I? Oh my god, I didn't even mix the makeup. But anyway, you guys, I'm just gonna say it. I'm scared. Unfortunately, it's not cute. But it is very Shrek colored, I will tell you that. Mix it all together and you know you got the best of both worlds. <laughs> I'm just gonna say it. I'm terrified. <gasps> Why am I living? Go away, Tate. You're all I want. You're all I have. <laughs> I'm not gonna send this video to people before I post it. Like, my friends that know that I'm making a channel, it's just asking for sadness. Like, what are they gonna say? Oh, great job. Like, you're green, you idiot. I don't know how to edit anything. I'm gonna be using iMovie and I'm not gonna be using it well, is what you need to know. Okay, well I can't make my eyeballs green because I have a glitter look right there. I didn't think this through. This is what we're sticking with. I'm gonna give Fiona an ombre lip. So we're gonna take an NYX. Okay. Oh, nope, that's not it. That looks like poop. Like, actually. <laughs> I look like a sad Grinch. I hope my family never sees this. Believe it or not, folks, yesterday was worse. So, you're getting the creme de la creme of footage here. Well, things have taken a turn, folks. I don't know what else to tell you. I feel like I'm looking like like Patrick from that old episode of SpongeBob where they used a bunch of curse words and got in trouble. That's what I think I look like. Okay, so we're gonna take our Cody Air Spun Powder and we're gonna just, <clears throat> kinda helps get a more even green. Cover up those brush strokes a bit or just take them right off, sure thing.
I would like to clarify that this is a water bottle. A lot of people think that it is a drink of some sort. Tis not. <coughs> Folks, this wig was five dollars at Walmart, and I'm not that mad at it. This is it. The final Fiona transformation. <sighs> well, this was fun to say the least. I don't think it came out nearly as bad as it did yesterday. I don't think it came out nearly as bad as I expected it to be today. Yeah, so it definitely could have been worse. It 100% was worse. Um, <gasps> and posting hopefully soon. Um, but yeah, so once again, thank you for checking this out. If you happen to stumble across it, um, definitely subscribe for more really awesome, fun content that's going to be literally just like this. Okay, the more I'm looking at it, the less I hate it. How is that? How is that? Okay. But anyways, so it's going to be a really fun time. We're going to do stuff like this all the time. I'm going to have some story times and some really fun things to go with those. So it won't just be me sitting in front of a camera. Um, I'm going to be doing some fun stuff. So I don't really know what's going to happen. I don't really know how this channel is going to be set up yet. Um, because I'm garbage and irresponsible. So yes. Thanks for coming. Um, I will see you at some point soon. I don't know when, but yeah. So not too many people are going to be sitting at the edge of their seats waiting, but yeah. So I'm excited. This is really hot and I'm going to take it off now.